Scientist, it's Ariana and I'm Chakoti and welcome back to another demo of the week. Today we're going to compare two demos, combustion of candy and the black carbon snake. Both demos involve the decomposition of sugar but they produce very different visual results. Let's start with combustion of candy. In front of me I have a gummy bear in a test tube of potassium chlorate. When I heat the test tube and drop the gummy bear in, the sugar in the gummy bear reacts with the oxygen in the melted potassium chlorate in a combustion reaction releasing carbon dioxide and steam. Now let's move on to the black carbon snake. In this demo, we are mixing sugar with sulfuric acid. When the two mix, the sugar again decomposes, but it does not release carbon dioxide. Instead, a solid piece of carbon forms, and water vapor is released. So why do these two reactions have different results? Wouldn't you like to know? I do, that's why I asked you. Oh, okay! Potassium chlorate and sugar react in a combustion reaction. Meanwhile, sugar and sulfuric acid react in a dehydration reaction. Combustion reactions always need an oxygen source, in this case, potassium chlorate, and always release carbon dioxide and water. Dehydration reactions pull water from the reagents, and they release water, but not carbon dioxide. This small difference makes two completely different reactions with the similar reagent. But my combustion reaction is better than yours. No, my dehydration reaction is way better than yours. No, combustion. Dehydration. Combustion. Dehydration. Combustion. Dehydration. dehydration. You better be joking. They're both pretty great. Hug it out. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.